Okay, let's do this um, problem, this uh, variability or oxidation um, problem, or these two problems. So, um, in it, you're um, taking a ketone or an aldehyde, and uh, you're reacting them with a peroxy acid. Okay, and what that's going to do is we're going to take this oxygen, remember the mechanism, and uh, put it in between one of the two groups that um, is alpha to the carbonyl. So um, if you remember your migratory aptitude, right, it's going to be H first, then tertiary, and secondary, um, then phenyl, then uh, primary, then methyl. Okay. So you have to remember that. Of course, uh, if not, then you won't be able to do these problems. Um, but anyway, so um, now all you've got to do is figure out what the carbon is, alpha, or in the lowercase hydrogen, is alpha to um, the carbonyl group. Um, so in this case, we're distinguishing between um, here, let's do it distinguishing between a primary and a secondary. So if we go over here and we look, secondary's got the greater migratory aptitude. So um, the product will be carbonyl with an oxygen there, and just this portion after the oxygen. Okay. So you can see you just stick the oxygen in between there. And same process with this one. You gotta remember this. H always comes first. It's the little guy. So it's gonna go in between there. So taking um, benzaldehyde and making benzoic acid. Because, of course, H has a greater Migratory H has a greater migratory aptitude than pH. And of course on the other one we were looking at um, the difference between secondary and primary. Okay. So um, if you want to uh, of course, remember the mechanism, too, and that'll help you out. Any questions? Okay.